guys? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hello, my name is Jane. I live in North Carolina at this moment. I'm moving to New York on Monday. So we're gonna do a little pack with me video. That's what's going on today. If you guys like today's video, be sure to click the thumbs up button and don't forget to subscribe if you're new. And if you are a new subscriber, comment below so I can say hi and thank you for subscribing to my channel. We are moving, we are packing, and I'm really sorry if this car is loud. I'm in my dad's car right now and it's just much louder than mine. Um, but my car is now my sister's car because I'm moving to New York and cars aren't a thing up there. I'll be on subway mode all day, every day. So first things first, I did make a list, but it's actually at home, but I know for a fact that I need to buy a couple of things at Ulta before I leave. I decided to buy them before I left because I just knew it would be cheaper here and I didn't want to buy something online and pay for shipping. So I'm just getting a couple of things. I literally just finished work like two seconds ago and I have one more day tomorrow and I have two days to pack. Packing up my whole life in two days in two suitcases. Wish me luck. So I'm back and I changed, got more of the dry shampoo that I always use and then back on my Tarte eyebrow pencil game. I bought the Urban, I almost said Urban Outfitters, the, the Urban Decay one and I just don't like it. I didn't like it, I didn't like the spoolie, I didn't like the color on my skin, I just didn't like any of it. I have two suitcases that I'm gonna bring in. One of them is a hard case, one of them is a soft. So I just separated things, like more breakable things I'm gonna put in the hard case and then mostly clothes are gonna go in the soft. So I separated that there. I'm gonna start by just packing my summer clothes and then like weigh it, see where we are and go from there. Yeah, these are just things that I think I'm gonna ask my parents to ship to me because I just don't think that I'm gonna have enough room in my suitcase. Tonight, I think I'm gonna actually start folding and putting things into different piles and just getting a little bit more organized in that sense. and then I took a shower. These are all my workout clothes that I'm taking. I'm literally selling. I still haven't put them on Poshmark, but I'm trying to sell so many workout clothes and I think just like slowly buy new ones. And then these are all the clothes that I'm taking. At least in my first batch. I think there's gonna be a few more, but it's really not that much. And these are just like my summer clothes and then that's like my fall and winter. I cut down a lot. I sold a lot of stuff, got rid of a lot of things. But I wanted to also give you guys a tattoo update. Yeah, so that's what it looks like right now. A little bit right around the edges. I did get a new soap. I got the um, Dial Antibacterial Gold and a pump version because last night I was super freaked out about the soap. If you watched the last vlog, you'll know all about it. But I was a little bit freaked out about which soap to get. And so I spent so much time last night reading a ton of different articles and stuff. That was the one that was mentioned the most and a lot of people said that they preferred it in a pump rather than a bar. That's what I did. Um, in case you wanted that update and then I'm still putting Aquaphor. I have to put it on right now. After I wash it, I always put Aquaphor on it. So yeah, that's just like a quick update of what's going on. Okay, so now I'm tackling all the areas that have turned into this, where it's just a bunch of junk for whatever reason, hanging out and I'm either recycling it or throwing it away or putting it in a drawer. I just feel like this is all the stuff that's really gonna get me overwhelmed. Also watching Instant Hotel. This is season two, it just came out. If you guys haven't seen Instant Hotel, you need to watch it stopping for the night. But these are all the clothes that I'm bringing. These are all the shoes that I'm bringing. I have a little bit of laundry to do. Knickknack stuff that I'm bringing. I cleaned out all my drawers here. That's some stuff I'm recycling. Just sold these two leggings, I'm also dusting. This is the jewelry that I'm gonna wear in the next few days. Everything else is packed. I'm also gonna try and sell these leggings, but this is all cleared off. These are all the athletic clothes that I wanna sell, but I just don't have time. We're moving right along in the process. My cat is here with me. I'm gonna spend the rest of the night editing. I just like physically don't wanna do any more work. Suitcase number one. Morgan's letting me borrow this. Thanks, girl. Number two. And this one, I didn't think it was so big, but actually it's huge. These are the clothes, the little knickknack stuff, and then there's just some other things. I'm not really sure what I'm gonna have to ship yet. It's like very me to like plan everything out and hopefully it'll go kind of smoothly. Um, I also wanna get my nails done, my eyebrows done, and I have some other errands. Yeah, to ship some stuff. Just like a lot to do today. Okay, this is not packing related. We're gonna try this out <laughs> and I'll do a little review, maybe in like a few months after I've tried it a few times. Morgan's inspired me. <laughs> I said, you need to go to Target? She said, yes, I need tampons. I said, well, I'm going to buy a menstrual cup. So I'm inspired. 
And you know what, this was only $32, so in reality, that's two periods. Yeah. Like okay, so these are all my clothes, and I'm actually really impressed with how much we fit in here, and don't have much left to fit in this other one, so this is good, because I can put all my home stuff in here, and I think I'll actually be able to take more homey stuff than I thought, like my books. I didn't think I was gonna be able to take those, but I think I might be able to. Also, we opened this <laughs> and read through all the instructions, and I'm very curious to start uh, to start this adventure, so stay tuned. <laughs> really quickly, while I'm at the stoplight, we're going to the post office, because I sold three pairs of leggings on Poshmark, bless. So I'm gonna go ship those now, and then I'm gonna get my brows done, then I'm gonna go get my nails done. So it's just a big adventure of a day today, and my mind is all over the place, and I can't keep anything straight, and I'm jumping. I feel like I've never felt more just like I can't focus on one thing. So I was feeling super spunky and got neon. They're like neon orange. I wanted them to be a little bit more coral, like a little bit more pink, but this was the closest thing that they had. And I was like, you know what, whatever, it's summer and I want something fun. So yeah, neon orange. The only thing is that the neon kind of stained around, you can see it on there kind of. See how the neon like stained, maybe the shadow? It like stained my finger a little bit. It did that on a few of my nails, but she told me that it would come off in like a day if I just showered, so. I'm realizing that the real issue here is that I don't think it's quite hit me yet that I'm leaving tomorrow. I think that's why I'm so, being so lazy about packing. Um, in case you're wondering how it's going, it's empty. <laughs> okay, I'm making myself get up. I'm gonna make myself do things that are productive. I need to turn this light on. person in the sense like I don't really hold on to a lot of stuff but this is a box of just all the things in my life that I have held on to. It has like journals and cards from people and all kinds of stuff and I was gonna leave this here but I think I actually have enough room to bring it and since it's not that much stuff but it is stuff that's really important to me I feel like I would like to have it with me. Okay, so this little thing is just something I keep in my bathroom to keep everything organized and it doesn't fit like conveniently in there, but I think I'm gonna bring it anyway because at least while I'm sub, this is empty, why? <laughs> at least while I'm subleasing, I feel like this would be a nice thing to have like in the bathroom with just all my stuff in it. But I'll probably get a new one once I move because I'm not a huge fan of this. I just don't like the dots. So I'm moving on to my bathroom. There's a lot of stuff in here that I just wanna throw away because they're like, almost empty, like my shampoo and conditioner are pretty much out. There's a lot of just old products that I've had for forever and feel guilty throwing away. Now's the time I kinda gotta do it. Okay, so these are all the skincare items that I either don't use anymore or I don't like, and so I have them all lined up. And these are actually two similar things from two different brands. These were given to me because I work at the spa and I didn't really like either of them. They're from two different companies. A couple of reps came in and gave them to um, for me to try, but these just don't really work with my skin um, and I have other stuff that I like better, so I'm actually just gonna ask if my friends want any of these. This has like a little bit left, so I might use this today and tomorrow and then pack my other face wash. This I really didn't like. Again, I'm gonna see if any of my friends want this because this just, it didn't do anything for me. This I'm throwing away. I've actually had this for a really long time and I did not like it at all and for some reason it's been sitting in here. This is so dusty, but I actually love this. This is what I use to clean my brushes. It's like a gel. I just got this from Sephora. And then this is a sunscreen. I'm gonna hold on to this one too actually because I'm running out of my sunscreen so I'll just switch over to this one. I always leave my coffee cups in here by accident. I'm really bad about that because I drink coffee in the morning while I get ready. Okay, something I've never thought about actually is to recycle these. So I just threw them away. <laughs> we're, gonna, we're gonna fix that. I don't know why, but I've actually never thought about recycling these, but until this moment and I looked in the back and I was like, why, am I, why have I never recycled these? So I know I talk about this face wash thing all the time, it's the one that vibrates, but just to tell you even more about how much I love it, this is the thing that it came in, and I actually kept it, and the charger fits in the bottom. Normally I have to do this with two hands, but I try to do it with one. I'll do it better in a second. Oh, actually, you know what, that's fine. 
so it actually fits in there and that hooks up there's a little plastic thing you can kind of see it that like holds this in place and then the charger just fits right under it it's also a usb charger so you can just plug it into anything and this is from amazon i'll link it below i'm obsessed with this and it just makes your face feel so nice after you're done this is kind of how packing is generally going for this one the other one i just went ahead and like closed up it's done so really not that much stuff my parents are gonna ship me my duvet and then i think i'm just gonna make like a pile of stuff that i want to be shipped to me after i move like i definitely this is part of the sound bar that i have and like i want that i just don't know if i want it right now this is generally where we're at so i showered and i changed into my christmas pajamas <laughs> this is literally what i'm gonna use between now and when i leave put all my shoes away that's what I'm wearing between now and the oh, this needs to be packed. That's just all my hair ties and stuff. Okay, so that's what this bag's looking like. I'm gonna head and close up this part. All that's left on here is stuff that I'm either gonna put in my carry-on or like this that I'm probably gonna use tomorrow. Um, this is the only area that's left that I haven't looked through, so I'm gonna do that right now and clean it up and then I'll be pretty much done. most part I think I'm done I'm gonna have to open this up again and pack just like a few more clothes and then I have some other clothes in the wash I'm exhausted I'm gonna go ahead and like take off all my makeup get ready for bed and then tomorrow is my last day in Raleigh which is insane Today is Sunday, it's my last day in North Carolina, my last day in Raleigh. I'm starting off the day with getting coffee with my friend Morgan, then we're gonna go to Orange Theory. And so I'm just wearing Ultra Boost, and then these are some Fabletics leggings. I always get compliments on these because it has that cool thing in the back, but they're just from Fabletics. And then this is just like that little Gymshark dreamy crop top. I also love these leggings because they're like super, super high waisted. Sweaty mess. We're at Target. Morgan's getting right. things to organize her vitamins. Um, and then I'm gonna figure out where Grant is. He should be here. So the boys are here and they went to Raleigh Beer Garden. So we're gonna go meet them and grab a beer really quick and then go home, get ready, and then we're all going out to lunch at Bar Taco, which is my favorite. Grant! 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 He's here! Grant's here. We're checking into our flight. Are you having so much fun? I am. I bought a new shirt. It looks great. Oh, we're a 10 out of 10, recommend. It's from Target. Jane Kylie Simmons at gmail.com. I think I'm giving you some really good. Um, yeah, your motion work is great. Thank you. I love that. It's because I just worked out, so I'm a little shaky. Yeah, awesome. <laughs> we're at Raleigh Beer Garden. So this is this is the Oberon beer, and like, yes, it has gluten in it. It's delicious. Go. This is the best beer I've ever had, and if you're not a beer lady, get this anyway. Uh -oh, I, I think everyone at this table got no beer. Morgan and Joe are also here. Yeah, Joe, what do you it's think of the Hmm. You know, <laughs> the hops, um, I'm not sure how I feel about the consistency. <laughs> We're about to go to lunch. We're going to Bar Taco. This is what I'm wearing. These are the Fila sneakers that I have. This is a dress from Urban Outfitters. I've had it for 500 years, and this is just the jean jacket I just got, so I just threw it on top. I'm just like waiting for them to figure out what the plan is because I don't have a car right now. I don't know why, 
but i just feel so calm right now about this whole move which is great because i was so anxious last week if you guys watched the last vlog you'll know but i just feel so like ready which is great that's a great feeling so we're gonna go to bar taco and do a little double date so we've pretty much taken all my luggage downstairs and i'm just like i really am excited to move and i'm and I like change, it's just like, I knew that, I just, I just have a hard time dealing with it sometimes. Yeah, I'm just stressed and I can't find like my charge, my camera charger and that just, like I'm just stressed and it's just like a lot to put all your life in two bags and call it a day. But we're about to leave and I'm just gonna hope for the best and assume that everything that I need is with me and I have to go say goodbye to my parents and I'm just, I'm gonna go do that and try to stop crying. Oh, I look like I've been crying. I'm wearing a shirt, I promise. I looked like topless for a second. We're on our way to Charlotte. We're flying out of Charlotte, and so we're driving there now. I'm done crying for right now. Thank God. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. I move to New York tomorrow. Tomorrow. <laughs> Which is crazy. Stick around, click the subscribe button, and never forget to love the life you lived. I will see you guys in my next video.